Hey CC, I'm just finishing work and I thought I would, uh, I was thinking today about maybe doing another review, but I don't want to get into doing that too often, but I thought if I'm going to make a video, I might as well do something that can help everyone and answer common questions that are often asked in the group or asked of me. Um, I'm just having this Arista Reserve Maduro, and I'm going to talk about Filling your lighter. So I use this Bugatti B2002. Highly recommend it. It's a great lighter, double torch. I prefer double torch. Single's too small, triple and quad get to be too big for the smaller gauge cigars. So double's pretty versatile in my opinion. So when filling your lighter, you can read the file section, which is going to tell you exactly what I'm going to do now. You could read the back of your butane which tells you exactly how to do it. But often these things get overlooked and people have a graveyard of lighters. So the first thing you do is get yourself good butane. This is the stuff I recommend. I find that some butane with some lighters, different combinations don't work so well. But this with any of my Zycar lighters or my Bugatti lighters, which are made by Vertigo, it works uh, really well. The key I think is a premium butane, so whatever it is, as long as it's uh, premium, so it has very little impurities to clog up the jets. And uh, it even works in, I think it's called the Firebird, it's a $14 lighter and it's a triple flame, and it works well in that too. But the key is uh, filling it properly, which the step that most people miss is taking some sort of tool, small screwdriver, Sidecar makes a tool, there are a bunch of lighter tools for purging. Um, so what you want to do is adjust the flame height to the minimum setting. So on this lighter it looks like that. So minimum setting on most lighters is a minus sign, plus is the highest flame setting, but whatever it might be different on different lighters. So you adjust that down and then you simply purge the air. So you press the inlet valve, try to do it without my hands being in the way, and you can hear the air come out. So that's has relatively little air in it. Now if this sat for a while and the heat could cause more air to build up. Sorry, I'm trying to get my hands out of the way, but yeah, so there's no air in there. And then you simply shake your butane, hold it like this, still on the minimum flame setting, fill it. There's a little sponge on these ones once you see that fully saturated. And another thing I do is because I can see my reservoir, I fart around with that little uh, air bubble in there. And I try to make that air bubble as small as I can. Now you don't have to do that and I don't really recommend it on the lighters where you can't see that air bubble because you could just be causing air locks and pushing more air in there than you need. So that's it. And now before I put it back in the cover there I just try to light it. So usually on minimum won't light. No. A lot of times you have to warm it up too. You'll feel it's cold to the touch. Especially in the winter, you'll have to bring it back to almost room temperature or uh, at least a bit warmer than when the butane goes right in. So then I adjust it halfway. Check it. So it's going out. So either I have airlock or it's not getting enough butane. I find with these Bugattis, they like to be on almost high. And there you go. You probably can't see, but you should be able to hear the flame. And you can see there's no air pockets or anything in there. And that's what you want. When you return it to the case, good to go. Now if you have it full and you filled it properly according to what the file section says or what I just said or what the butane says and it's sputtering still then it might mean that you need to clean out your jet so you can use compressed air to clean those out um, you just have to make sure you don't ruin that contact in there that igniter a lot of times the problem with the lighter is that igniter that little ceramic igniter in there gets cracked and that's when, no matter what you do, your lighters won't work. But the majority of lighters that I had that I thought didn't work, I was able to bring back by purging them properly. 
and filling them with premium butane. Um, I don't have a cigar out here right, with me right now, other than the one that I've already lit. So maybe in the future I'll do something about the V-cutters. A lot of people ask about them and maintenance and cleaning on them. So maybe down the road I'll do something like that. But I hope this helped. Again, this information's in the file section. It's all over the internet. Um, just have to get all those steps together. Most people forget to turn that dial down to minimum when they're purging and when they're filling. Okay, thanks very much. Have a good night.